Hello everybody, Andrew Majeski here with Dental L. So in my practice, Dental L Mobile Hygiene, I focus on prevention, but much, much more than that is I focus on the, the individual needs of every single person because we're all different. It's not just about having to brush twice a day and having to floss every day, limiting sugar, drink lots of water. It's so much more than that. If I said that to everybody and then said, okay, thank you, see you in six months, I wouldn't be doing my job properly. So just another way how I am doing dental differently is I look at the whole person as an individual. So. Let's just say you have been to the dentist before and you get six cavities every time you come in. You were probably told in the past, you know, you need to brush twice a day, you need to start to floss every day, you need to not have sugar, drink lots of water and see you in six months, you know, and that's it, right? But there's so much more than that. If you're getting a lot of cavities, it's not it's probably not because you're eating sugar every day, every second, every day. You know, it's so much more than that. The pH level in your mouth is probably on the more acidic side, and it just makes it easier to get cavities. But the good news is that can be helped. So I would use something like a toothpaste. Um, let's see here, a toothpaste that contains xylitol, okay? So, whoops, French side, there we go, xylitol. So. It's so much more than just simply saying to use Crest or Colgate because there's sodium fluoride in there. And that does help to protect the teeth against cavities. But you need to take it a step further where you don't want the cavities to have a chance to form in the first place, right? So with the sodium fluoride, which you, you've all heard is a, is a good thing for your teeth topically, it does help to protect the teeth. So it is wonderful stuff. It is excellent stuff. But at home, I want everybody to be using a xylitol toothpaste because xylitol actually helps to neutralize the pH level in our mouth to not cause a cavity in the first place. So if you're coming to me because you get cavities every single time, you just simply think that that's normal. It's not. I'm going to ask you to use a different toothpaste. See you back in six months. I can almost guarantee you will not have a single cavity as long as you're, you're using the toothpaste twice a day. It is recommended, of course, to floss every day, but not a lot of patients do, and that's okay. As long as you're able to use that toothpaste, I might be seeing you more often for cleanings if you can't get in there in between the teeth every day, but still, you don't, having to floss every day isn't the be all end all. Yes, I said it, I'm a dental hygienist, but I'm kind of doing my own research with other things. There are other things that you can do. Or what about you have sore um, gums all the time and you're afraid to go to your dental hygienist to get your teeth cleaned because your gums are so sore. There are things that we can do. So we can look and say, okay, why are the gums sore? Are they sore because you haven't had your teeth cleaned in 10 years? That's possible. All that means is that we do need to clean in there to get that plaque and tartar out. The gums heal up so quickly, you will be amazed. But doing that cleaning would be uncomfortable. But there are things that we can do to make the gums not feel any pain. I like to use something, this little bottle here. It is a desensitizer. So it's not your typical um, needle, local anesthetic where they numb the whole mouth. It's not that. This is something that I can, I, I can actually apply to those areas that are sensitive. It works right away and it's localized. If it's been 10 years since your last cleaning, I might have to apply it a couple times, but it does work. You will be amazed. I have patients who I see and they, and they ask for this every time. They say, can I have that desensitizer stuff? Because it does work. This is the first cleaning that I have ever had that I have not been in pain. And that's an amazing thing to hear. This little bottle works its magic. You will be amazed. You do not have to be sore for your dental cleanings. Even if it's your first cleaning in 10 years, it doesn't matter. I don't care. I'm just happy to see you and clean those teeth. I'm a dental hygienist. It sounds crazy, but I like dirty teeth because I get excited to clean everything off for you and then show you how amazing things can look. Let's take something else. Let's say you are cold sensitive 
all the time. There are toothpaste that you can use to help to seal up those um, tubules actually in your teeth that are open, causing that cold sensitivity um, reaction. There are toothpaste that you can use to cover that ent like entire thing up. It leaves a nice thin layer over the teeth that you're not cold sensitive. Plus, you should be having um, a sodium um, varnish with the fluoride applied by your dental hygienist at least every six months. I like to say even every three months because it just helps to really coat those teeth. You will not be cold sensitive anymore. Using, again, my little desensitizer, I can actually place this over those areas and it does last for six months, you guys. Six months. So I would apply this, you would use that toothpaste and it works for six months. You will not be cold sensitive anymore. So it's so much more than just simply saying, okay, your teeth are cold sensitive, use Sensodyne, see you later, thank you so much. We need to be doing so much more. Another thing, what if your mouth has limited saliva? If you're one of those people where your saliva, there's just not a lot in there, your mouth is dry most of the time. Using toothpaste helps, but, but um, specifically a toothpaste with xylitol. Xylitol helps to stimulate saliva. Finding a toothpaste in the store though with, with xylitol is next to impossible. Talk to me, I can try to find something for you. If you are a patient of mine, I always have all of my fun stuff in stock. So you can have this, okay? This makes you happier, makes me happier, the teeth, the mouth, everything is, is a lot happier. But if your mouth is dry along with a toothpaste, you should also be using a mouth wash with xylitol it doesn't have to be this company but again try to find a mouth rinse with xylitol in it it's very very difficult this has 10 percent xylitol i believe yes use this twice a day it does help to bring back that saliva so it doesn't just cover things up and make the mouth feel better it helps to bring back saliva can we say amazing have you ever heard about this before probably not there are new things out there that works it, it truly, truly does. Um, I do a lot of research. I attend the dental convention, so I learn about all of this. I test this first on myself, on people I know, plus I do my research. So all of my stuff has been tested over the past five months, and it works, you guys. I see children, adults, seniors. It works. You just have to take the time to kind of go, hmm, what do you need? What does she need? What does he need? Your dental cleanings do not have to be painful. You do not have to be lectured about brushing and flossing. It's so much more than that. So just a way how I do dental differently, I am very happy to help. Let me know, you guys, if you're a patient, if you're a dental professional, if you're a student, talk to me. I am more than happy to help anybody because it's so much more and it should be so much more than brushing and flossing. Thank you guys for listening and I'll see you in the next one.